Oh, this is so clean. Is there more or less latency? There, the latency seems about, it's the same, um, but I'm detecting like more like jutter or motion uh -huh. blur a little bit. Um, it makes it easier to see because the resolution is higher. Like in my, if I'm still, I have a very clear picture and as soon as I start moving, uh, it becomes clear that I'm that I'm moving. I'm seeing more blur, but uh, it's beautiful. Not the children. Oh, yeah, um, playing dumpy right now, so swinging the trunk back and forth, uh, and everything's so clear. This can make a big gameplay difference because I'm able to see farther and farther into the, to the distance. Into the distance, there's yeah. more di resolution. Absolutely. So that makes a big difference. Like playing Boone's Trench Run or playing. Um, a few other games like uh, Jamulus or so forth, like you see something that you can only see so far before you can't tell the pixels are too close. Uh, with this version, you can definitely have a, um, a farther field of view with distance, which is really, really awesome. Uh, so that's going to help gameplay. So, ah! Oh, my. Yeah. This is beautiful. <laughs> yeah. Super clean. Super awesome. You able to see so far? Oh, that's good. Definitely. As far as the motion blur and stuff like that, is that like, because I'm like, still working on that? So, yeah, motion blur on 600 displays is basically just the fact that it gets lit and then when you move, it's still there. And so, you know, but you're transporting a lot more data now, too, across the wire, right? Physically. True. The panel, the panel's still at the same, um, at the same frequency. At the same, uh, these aren't like LEDs. Uh, they're still just you know regular LCD screens. So from DK1 to DK2, like what is in here now is basically an LCD screen at high def. Uh, so you're still getting the same type of motion. Where it's actually uh, less, but it's, well, I shouldn't say it's less, but it's um, it's. It's almost as much as what you see on the game. But we are looking at ways to go. Is there like a literally a ghosting effect on, on those screens? Like, you know, the, when you light the pixel and you turn it off, it doesn't immediately go black, it kind of fades a little bit. When you're up to the screen, you're actually looking at a static screen, right? And you're, you're moving this way. You're not you know, you're not blurring anything, but as soon as you actually take a virtual world and see it across the screen, yeah. it's just a it's just an artifact of hardware. Yeah. Which is solvable, but it requires higher, you know, higher refresh rates, uh, harder and shorter. Um, yeah, you'd have to interrupt its signal quicker yeah. instead of like waiting an extra cycle or whatever. Yeah. Yeah, we've seen we've seen results that actually uh, All right. Okay. You're still going to have to. Yeah. 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 This game is such an asset trip, but it's good. We respect. Oh, it's almost over. Oh, he didn't hear any of this. There's no light. There's no light. There's no light. Oh, he went to the headphones on. You didn't know. You didn't hear anything. Oh, no. No, I haven't. Well, like, what's going on, man? Is it for him? Is it for him? Oh, this is all right. He didn't hear any of this. 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 I'm going to blow up the Death Star this moment. Yeah. Well, this is a pretty long trench, right? They probably don't know. Wireless versions. All right. Yeah, we try. We try. We try. So you can change this out or no? That is awesome. You want me to back these um back my own too? You know what? I'm trying to power them. Alright, yeah. Before you press anything, make sure to look all around to the left, right behind you as well. All the way behind you. Oh yeah, oh there's RQD2. Yeah, yeah back here ready to go. I'm putting earphones on you. So you look at the character that has the detonator and it'll start to level up with the Thank <laughs> you. 